G'day everybody, it's Alex again. Well, I was uh, having a chat with uh, Ed Sissel. It's not a chat, I sent him a message. I was going to set this up the other day before he did his one. And uh, he says, uh, go for it. And he'd probably like to see it as well. Um, yeah, it's a bit of a redneck contraption. I'll get the uh, camera off the tripod and uh, show you the components. Okay, first off we have a 2.2kW uh, three-phase motor. People might recognise it from one of my other videos. <laughs> um, port of power for a belt tensioner, how's that? Nice tension. Perfect. 24V uh, 50 amp Isuzu truck alternator. Of course we've got the light there for field current, connected to the positive. 24 volt batteries hooked up with redneck jumper leads. Three phases hooked up properly, including the earth. Properly wired up face to face. Battery volts. And current. Now, if you have a look there, this alternator is very naughty. It's actually drawing nearly a 0.9 of an amp, 0.8 of an amp away from the battery. And it's not running. I'd say that's why the truck had an isolator switch on it because otherwise the alternator would drain it flat. Alright, time to go back to the tripod. We'll put this, uh, put this on here. And uh, I'll start it up. Give it a run. Just like this. Okay, just uh, monitor the uh, voltage levels there. What I'm going to do is dump some power out through a uh, 24 volt power pack. Wind this up. Oh, they recover alright, but I think these batteries really are on the shonk. They're stuffed. Alright, time to charge it up again. And there we go. Um, I think you'd call this a redneck. Uh, hey, it's a mechanical 
Mm. Nah. Yeah, it's like a uh, three phase, like a rotary converter, but three phase to fucking 24 volt single phase uh, DC. Yeah, I'll get it right one day. Um, anyway, I hope that's a little bit educational. And uh, the last thing to show you is uh, I really like this. My redneck porter power belt tensioner. Need more tension? Just push on the handle. <laughs> Thanks for watching.